Save the Children is opening its first specialist Ebola treatment center in Sierra Leone as part of its wider fight to treat and stop the spread of Ebola. The 80-bed facility in Kerrytown, near the capital Freetown, provides diagnosis and treatment to infected patients and to ensure that children receive necessary care and protection. The Ebola crisis that's affecting Sierra Leone but also Liberia and Guinea is so enormous and we're in a race against time to make sure that we can prevent it spreading but also to treat people who have got Ebola and also to build on for the future something that we can prevent it happening and again. And so it was so enormous that we couldn't not step up to the mark and do our best. But we've never done something like this treatment centre. There's 80 beds here. It's enormous for us. And it was a risky decision, but it's something that I feel very proud about. The Kerrytown Ebola Treatment Centre was built by British Army engineers and will be run by Save the Children, a non-governmental organisation. The centre will have more than 200 frontline medical staff, including a contingent of Cuban doctors with around 50 on shift at any one time. A further 50 to 70 non-clinical support staff and more than 100 hygienists will also be based at the Kerrytown site, with 100 to 120 staff working at the centre at any given time. In addition, the centre will house a small separate clinic run by the UK Ministry of Defence to treat both Sierra Leonean and international health workers should they become infected with the virus. Many of our staff have lost dozens of relatives in this, in this crisis. I met one of our education advisors that lost 14 members of his family. So they're dealing with a huge amount of pressure and anxiety. They're heroes in this struggle against Ebola. And the international staff who are coming in to support this, nurses and doctors and logisticians and health advisors, they also have that anxiety from their families left home and they're really making a difference. So the real heroes of this fight against Ebola are those local and international staff who are really here in the front line.